Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Worship Gunner 2. Today, uh, well, last time we finished all of the special missions, so today we're going to be doing some training missions and basically just going through uh, and doing those missions again. Um, and now we're basically going to start working on trying to get everything we need to start, you know, unlocking the rest of the stuff. So, we're going to begin by trying to figure out what we need to get uh, some slightly better upgrades and stuff like some better parts and things like that so the one thing well one of the things um, I think we were stuck somewhere in the fusion reactor line waiting for the next fusion reactor to come up yeah so we need fusion reactor 3 which means playing the game on hard difficulty um, on one of those special missions let me go pull that up real quick because that is somewhere here <laughs> Nope, not that one. This one here. Oh gosh. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, so 750 we have to play on hard difficulty to get that fusion reactor. Um, that's going to be huge for our ability to move our ships around quickly and, and save on weight so that we can have more weapons. So, uh, we're pretty much going to, from this point, we're going to just be playing the game in hard, which I already did. Um, and that is basically just make sure we actually have the ability to get everything in the game because obviously some stuff only drops on hard so with that um, that also means we're gonna have to be taking our ship design a little more seriously than we have been so far so let's see this guy's doing 70 knots uh, oh yeah we're at the parts limit but we're not actually at the uh, weight limit yet I tend to forget that that actually becomes an issue on the battleship. Uh, this one whole battleship, I should say. Hmm. <laughs> well, it doesn't have a ton of armor. We can probably beef that up. Oh, wow, we can't. Jeez, that's drastic. Um, hmm. Well, then. Do we have... What kind of system do we have? We have EM shield. So where is the... Let me go find in page here. What is that? Let me remember. Okay, 750. That's the one... That's the one we're probably going to do today, um, if not something else as well. Let's see, we need the high gravity shield. That's what we need. Oh, we only get one of those, and we only get it for killing 100 super weapons. Wow, that kind of sucks. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, that won't be an option quite yet. Uh, I guess we're just going to have to... I mean, it's a it's a solid design as is. So I think we're just gonna have to roll with it and try it out. We are at hard already. Let's go ahead and do. Let's go ahead and do <clears throat> 750. This can be this can be a little rough. This one on on even regular you know, normal difficulty. All right, and we can skip dialogue now because we've seen it all. And let's just focus on killing. Oh, the performance is not great. Enemy At sunk. least they're dying quickly. That's the good news. Enemy sunk. Enemy but this is why I love sunk. having massive, massive cannons in this game. This is very, very, very good. Oh shoot, you know what? We might be on EL2 right now and I totally forgot to check. That's a problem. Because I don't think we can get it on EL2. I think we only can get it on EL1. Chaff, flare. I'm going to zoom this camera out so we can see. Um, we need to go find out where all these aircraft are coming from. Oh yeah, there's carriers, that's right. Hard over to starboard, yes, got it. Hard over to port. Got that health crate. I think I missed it. Did. Ah, oh well. It's only a 10% health crate, so it's not absolutely insanely good. I need to be keeping up with these damn destroyers. I'm making sure I kill them as soon as they get close to me. Oops, there we go. Fumbling my buttons just a little. You and you. Ow. 
Ow. What was that? That hurt. This, this. Oh gosh. Get close. Hello. Use torpedoes, please. Okay, cool. Going okay here. I want to go find those carriers soon, but I gotta kill. Oh boy. I'm not leaving that alone. I found that out the hard way the last couple episodes. <laughs> It's seriously almost worth getting rid of the bow jet thruster and putting on a fire extinguisher instead. I'm, I'm really about to do that. Like a high level fire extinguisher system. Um, alright, let me chaff, chaff, chaff. Oh my gosh, yeah, we need to go kill those carriers so these planes go away. Yeah, leave me alone. I'd love to. Um, there's another. No, 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 no. Where are they? Alright, hang on. Here, let's kill this guy. Since he's right here. We're gonna fire off a bunch of chaff, flare, more chaff, and then we're gonna repair. Just quickly, hopefully. Good god, there's so many planes. Where are those damn carriers at? They're right there. Okay. I need to kill them. Fire some more chaff. Keep moving. There we go. There's one. I know I've got destroyers all around me too, but I need to get rid of these carriers. Chaff. Go for the destroyers. Oh yeah, you take damage from running into stuff. You need to be careful. I don't know if I got all of the carriers, but I definitely got most of them. And that's gonna be good enough for our purposes here. That is a health crate. Need that. Flare, chaff. Oh yeah, I definitely got rid of most of the carriers. health crate at. Yep. Get it. I want the parts crate because that's kind of what we're here for, except I think, like I said, I screwed up and put us on EL2 and I needed to be on EL1, but we'll still probably get something useful out of this, I'm sure. Ooh, that's a big health crate. I need that. <clears throat> Let's go for that one. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Yeah. Oh, come on. Put the fire out, please. I don't want to have to... No, fine. I was trying not to use that, but I didn't want to sit around and wait for my magazine to blow up. Ah, oh boy. Flare. Now that the air thread is gone, I can put my own aircraft up. They can help me, whoops, can help me start grabbing some crates here. Stop turning while I'm trying to shoot you. Ow. Okay, they are using torpedoes. That's what it sounded like hit me anyways. Hi. Uh-oh. Oh, don't ram him. Whoa. Wow, the frame rate took a serious hit there. Um, slow down here. Get this guy to deal with. There we go. Flare, chaff. Another little destroyer here. Man, oh man. And then there's one more over here. And something way out to the uh, east as well. Now the treasure, we are on EL2 for this mission, which means we should be able to get the treasure. But I don't know where the treasure is. It's the dev plan for the photon gun, which is pretty sweet. But after clearing all enemies, transport appears in south. Ignore it and head north for cargo plane, heading south along the west edge. Oh, okay then. Heading south along the west edge. <clears throat> There's a halberd. That was interesting. I wonder. <clears throat> I don't think that was our. I don't think that was our treasure though. So, uh, is this last ship a transport or is it just? No, it is a destroyer. So after we kill this, the destroyer should or the transport should spawn in the south, and then the plane should spawn in the north or northwest. 
heading south. I think. If I'm understanding what this thing is trying to tell me correctly. Can we get me a destroyer? <laughs> I love how fast these cannons fire. It's absolutely ridiculous, but... Oh, go, go, go. That must be our transport, which, of course, I want to ignore. Well, it might not be the transport, but... I'm going to assume that it is. I'm going to try to get my high angles and whatnot working over the uh, shoreline here. Oh yeah, I forgot there's submarines in there too. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. Dialogue. Not too worried about that. <laughs> Looking around for aircraft. I think that other ship down there may just be. May just be another destroyer. Enemy ship sunk. 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 They're dropping parts Enemy crates over there. Hopefully my helicopters go and get them. Enemy ship sunk. There's also a ton Enemy of submarines. Sunk. Like a ton of submarines. Hmm. All right. Well, um, let me see here. I want to quickly turn around with my big guns. Oh, there's an airbase there. I totally forgot about. I wasn't launching planes at me though, so. Oh, just get out of range of the penguin. Oh no, I got it. Nice. What did he drop? Parts. Of course he did. Now, as for what kind of parts we can expect to see... Um, Fusion Reactor 4 is the S rank. That's actually the exact same as the L1. Um, treasure is... Oh, we're on 750, not 760. So let me make sure I read the correct... Yeah, okay, I read the correct guide for the treasure location. Oh, here we go. There he is. Get it, get it, get it. Yeah, nice. <laughs> um, so, it's not the dev plan for the photon gun. It is a napalm missile, which is cool, but I don't know if we're going to use it. Might try it at one point or another, but I don't think we're actually going to use it necessarily. Um, oh, yeah, that doesn't work on hard difficulty. I can't just, like, pause the game and see how many enemies are left. It's one of the things they change for their difficulty. So we'll just have to head over here and try to see if we can find any more submarines and stuff. That might be the last sub right there, but if he's on the other side of the island, we're not going to be able to get him with our... with our, uh, Azurax. <sighs> Staying right close to that uh, torpedo launcher, too. Oh, shit. Oh, don't it. sink now. That'd be really bad. Enemy ship sunk. Full speed ahead. Secondary objective complete. See, hitting these things is a pain. Just gotta get them at, like, the right angle. There we go. We've located... Uh, are we done? Okay, cool. Nice. So you don't have to destroy literally every building. Just just about. Hmm, that took a little while. But at least it should be a little easier on EL-1 when we actually try to go for our Fusion Reactor 3. So there's that. Fusion Reactor 4. Battleship Boiler. A lot of engine parts here. There's our treasure, which is new. But, you know. All right. Let's uh, make sure I do this right this time. EL1. Uh, the character, you know, the, the adjutant doesn't matter. But, all right, one more time on EL1. I think it'll be easier. I don't think we have those stupid little 
destroyers all over the place harassing us. No, we don't. Nice. It's good, but it's also a little bad because they were a good source of parts, or, you know, extra parts. All these hood class battleships don't stand a chance against the Kulu Yaku. <laughs> <laughs> I love getting all those survivors like that. Alright. Oh, we still have the Wilkin flag on here. We never put the championship pennant on. That sucks. Ow, ow, ow. All those bombs start to add up, and then of course they're going to end up setting some fires too, which is never fun. Now, are all of the carriers actually outside of the base right now? They're not like in the harbor? Because that'd be sweet for me. Yeah. Let's try to kill them now while they're not in the middle of all the buildings. It's gonna make it hard to target them. Oh, no, no, no. Stop the dialogue. Leave me alone. Okay, let's kill those carriers. Need to start slowing down. Mines in front of me. There's a fire. As I expected. Chaff. Um, Alright, and let's try to go ahead and put out the fire real quick. There we go. And once we have dealt with these mines, we can go over here. Get the crates from the carriers. Hopefully, there's a few parts crates in there. Um, and then we can get the submarines, too. Maybe the carriers didn't drop any crates for us. I guess they didn't, which is a little sad. I'm just gonna go very, very slowly through here. That's a mine. That's a mine right in front of me that my, my machine guns have not hit yet. Ow! Yeah, this hurt real bad. Where are the rest of these aircraft coming from? I really need my machine guns to get on the mine clearing job here. Like that one right in front of me. That one over there. Where are the rest of these planes coming from? I'm pretty sure we got all the carriers. Come on, CIWS, get these mines out of the way for me. Yeah, they hurt real bad if you run into them. Alright, so there's two different minefields. There's this one that we that we just cleared out here, and then there's one like above the submarines there that is also easy to get stuck in because you want to go after the submarines. And then you aren't paying attention and you're not being careful. Is up here. Airborne units, attack. Full speed ahead. Left Enemy ships sunk. All these parts and stiff. We're gonna get a lot of parts crates out of this. Hopefully, Secondary at least one of them is our uh, intended goal here. The uh, fusion reactor. All right, so he's gonna get the health. I kind of want to keep backing up towards this. Uh, I kind of want to keep backing up towards this, um... That's great, just to make sure that we actually get it. Gotta turn around here, because we've got that other island with an airbase and a couple other little things on it. Way back there. Um, and then, of course, this other torpedo launcher here. Here's hoping we actually got our fusion reactor for all the trouble. We got at least the treasure, and there's nothing else new on EL2 um, in terms of like regular parts crates there. So yeah, there we go.
and done. Let's see. Fingers crossed. Come on. Come on. Uh, Fusion Reactor 4. Yeah. I have five of those steam turbines. Yes, nice. We have Fusion Reactor 3. We got a few of them as well. Doesn't matter. Because we only need the one, so we can start researching them. Which means now we can back out of this. We can go to oh, R&D. And finally, we can begin researching our uh, our next fusion reactors. Oh, uh, yeah. There we go. What was that, 150,000? That's easy, man. We can spend that. We've got 10 million funds we're sitting on here. I don't want to go nuts, though, so we'll just... Well, actually, that's the last one. I'll go nuts. Sure. So there we go. We've got Fusion Reactor 4. I'm going to go sit those on the battleship and just see how much better it is for speed and everything. And maybe it'll even reduce our weight a little bit. Uh, might have to start sacrificing some... Like, a pair of ram launchers and a pair of high angles and a pair of CIWS just to get more parts availability. And then we can add more guns. But first, before we try any of that, let's go in here, go to our engines. Oh, we're still sitting on nuclear reactors here. Oh, okay. Well, how about, let's go to the engines, let's go ahead and remove the nuclear reactors. And then we're going to go ahead and put in our fusion reactors, like so. Which are actually the same size, but at the, uh, are much more powerful. Two, three, four... Five, six, seven, eight? Yeah, okay. We're a little heavier, actually. So if we did six of them, we're about the same weight we were, and about the same speed. But we can put more of them... Well, actually, because we had eight reactors. So we, if we have eight fusions, we're a little heavier, but we're also four knots faster. So, yeah, I mean... Could theoretically just if if I don't care too much about speed, and at this point I don't, because honestly, what's four knots at the end of the day on a ship like this? Um, that puts us at the same weight for less engines with the same speed, which means I can move all this stuff back. I actually have parts uh, limit, you know, to play around with now. I have I have a little bit of leeway on that, and so yeah. Let me see here. Now, how do I want to do this? Because I would love, if I can, to bring these guys back. Oh, yeah. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. And then what we can do, somewhere, um, let's see, I wanna move these chaff. Well, I'll just move them out here for now. Just get them out of the way. Um, and we can take these guys. Go. We can go ahead and have two of them here and here yeah nice we're still within our weight limit too we are a little slower but now we have extra guns which is very helpful extra guns firing forward at least but i like it all right cool i'll call that an upgrade well uh that will do it then for this episode of worship gunner 2 thank you very much for watching hope you've enjoyed and as always hope to see you all in the next one